There is one thing I could do with some help with, um, and I'm sure somebody out there already knows, but I can't find the instructions on how to do it. What it is, is the third seat here, because it's obviously a singular one in the back. I don't know, A, I don't need it, but B, it's in the way, so I want to get rid of it, because at the moment, you, you flick it here, it folds up, but how do you get it out? Because I, I would expect that these levers would release it, but they don't actually do anything. So, if anybody actually knows how to get this seat out, I'd appreciate it, because I want to get rid of this one. Um, it just takes up too much space. Because, you know, accessing the back seat. I've got three seats on the back. That the odds of me having six people sat in the back of the van is pretty slim. But if I take this one out, I can fit a smaller cool box in the same space. And then the next challenge is what am I going to do with this? Um, yeah. And I know I keep saying I'm not going to upgrade or spend too much money on the van, but these are all little bits bits and pieces for repair wise. Um, it's a bit like a new antenna. In typical van door style, somebody snapped this one off. I've got another one coming all the way from sunny China. So that new antenna will be going on very soon. Um, and that's it for this month. What I'm trying to do is just spend like maybe 50 100 euros a month on the van. It's just doing bits and pieces on it in a minute. The the engine's the major one. Uh, but like I said, the big problem with that is I'm a bit worried about taking it off the road for too long. So I need to find a good mechanic that can actually just turn around and go, yeah, I need it all day. Um, but I can guarantee that it will be finished by the end of today. So we drop it in. We'll have it done by the afternoon. Um, I don't want any manana manana. <laughs> Thanks for watching.